one of the things I think that's really smart to do that you do is um, do DNA testing because there's so much in information in those reports that you get back if you know how to interpret them like you do. Uh, so many things that you can correct before you get pregnant. And I've I found that in people. I've looked at the problems where they couldn't get pregnant. I'm trying to think, oh, one, one woman, she couldn't get pregnant. They really wanted to have a baby. They you know, had enough spacing between the first one and the new one they wanted to have. But when I looked at her, at her genes, a whole bunch of her fatty acid genes, she had like SNPs or variants in all of them, just literally all of them. And so just simply putting her on, uh, well, PEMT. She also had a PEMT SNP, which is really critical, choline for the baby's brain and for the cells. Um, and then taking, you know, most omega-3 and omega-6 fatty acids. She, in about, I don't know, eight weeks, she answered me back in an email and she said, we have, we we're expecting a baby. So it is amazing what you can, I mean, I wish people understood that it's one of the most important things can, to do. And so you offer that testing, so you can just talk about that a little bit, a little bit, please. For sure. We basically have settled on ancestry, ancestry DNA as our preferred uh, testing system. It's the most affordable that we know about. It's usually around $100. And you get this raw data file. That's what you pay them to do. And then you download a raw data file and you upload it to um, someone who I've been following a long time, uh, Sterling Hill. She has a group called MTHFR support.com and that's that per, that creates a 60 page pdf that i read and, and will interpret and you can kind of look through it yourself too but there's other companies in the space you know once i kind of find the, the i build the relationships with the people i work with i i know there's a lot of other stuff going on in the in the in the marketplace mm -hmm. but um again i'm nothing wrong with making a profit but i do try to make it affordable for people i feel like that'll help make it something that people are willing to do, you know? And, um, and you know, I do use a different company, but if somebody's already got uh, used another company, and there's a handful yeah, of good sure. ones out there, you can still still spend another $100 and go ahead and do Ancestry so that they could work with you. Because that's sure. your and actually, preferred I, I, see, I see testing, uh, Donna, I get testing from patients all over the place, and they bring me 15 different genetic reports. Uh, I have my favorite, but if somebody's already done genetic report, usually if there's enough information in there, you can work with it. But, um, but you just, the general principle of looking at it uh, to see where somebody has a tendency to be stuck is a great thing. And I think what you're mentioning in that case study is, you know, healthy animals get pregnant, just to be brutally honest, and unhealthy animals have a hard time carrying a baby. You've got to be healthy in your own self so that you can have enough extra to build someone from scratch. It's a pretty amazing thing uh, that it happens, and um, we well, need to support these, these individuals for sure.